Trust building between different organizations is essential. Collaborative initiatives often begin at newsroom level, where staff find the benefits of collaboration easier to identify than senior executives, who may be overly focused on exclusivity or other competitive factors. Each organization has to take responsibility and legal advice within its own territories, but sometimes complex coordination on stories and embargoes has to be agreed. Confidentiality is crucial and needs to be supported by a high level of communication hygiene, for example, encryption. By the time that a whistleblower has contacted a news organization, their identity may already be compromised. Secure channels of communication such as Dropboxes need to be set up and publicized. There are individuals and foundations prepared to fund investigative journalism, but agendas need to be understood and managed in the interests of transparency. Technology and the ability to develop and modify software or other technology to suit the needs of a particular project is crucial. Developers and journalists need to work in an integrated way. A neutral partner such as a non-profit news organization or joint venture can play a valuable role in managing tension and potential conflicts of interest between partners. In the end, one trusted party has to make decisions and hold other partners to account. This editorial coordinating calls on the traditional strengths of news editing and management but with additional responsibilities and skills required to manage across organizations and geographies. The rise in multinational collaboration reveals something about the state of the news industry. With business models disrupted by digital platforms, many organizations that were once regarded as mighty news institutions are struggling to get by or to field the scalar resources required for long and complex investigations. At the same time, there has been a rise in small startup organizations, some commercial, some non-profit organizations, seeking to establish and differentiate themselves in a crowded market. These two groups are often perceived as being in conflict with one another, with the startup insurgency seeking to undermine big legacy media. But, in truth, they often need each other in the new communication environment.